Hi, my name is Paul Nguyen, Technical Marketing Engineer, and today we'll be talking about the Cisco Wireless Best Practices Adoption. We will talk about and show the four various ways of implementing the wireless best practices, starting with the Wireless LAN Controller WLAN Express Setup, which provides a day zero, day one, ease of use, out of the box experience. With the WLAN Express Setup, an admin can easily and quickly configure a wireless LAN controller out of the box. The admin then follow a minimal set of steps needed, such as entering the system name, providing date time, and the networking info. A WLAN creation is simply entering the new SSID name and the security requirement. And if needed, a guest network can be created as well. Starting in 8.1, we can also apply RF parameter optimization. And what it does, it allows RF profiles to be applied to the common coverage zone and allows RRM to operate accordingly. The admin is then taken to a confirmation page where the configuration can be reviewed. And once clicking apply, this will apply the complete configuration and implement the best practices on the controller. These are the list of best practices that are applied as defaults after the WLAN setup. Next, let's take a look at the Wireless LAN Controller Upgrade Audit Workflow. This is a new feature being included in the Wireless LAN Controller software, in which a dashboard is available to the admin and allows a direct access to the best practices audit. This dashboard presents the admin with an easy overview of the configuration compliance based on best practices. The admin can simply click on a fix it now that will quickly apply configuration to the controller without having to go through the individual screens or manual CLI configuration. And from here, each best practices can be enabled and thereby increasing the compliance level as needed. In addition to infrastructure best practices, there are also security as well as RF management best practices. And if the admin needs to know more information, simply click on learn more and it will be directed to our continuously updated best practices documentation. Having a best practice dashboard and audit feature directly on the controller provides great benefits and allow a quicker adoption in best practice of the wireless LAN. The next method we'll be talking about is the Wireless LAN Controller Config Analyzer. This is a Windows application, and when installed, the admin can load one or more Wireless LAN Controller config files and be able to perform audit and compliance check on the wireless best practices. The Config Analyzer presents a report of all the controller and their best practices. Each by detailed number of best practices. We can drill down into a list of controllers and see the best practices for either summarized for all controllers and we get a percentage of compliance as well as going into each of the controller and be able to get individual controller best practices scores there as well. We can explore the individual sections such as AP, General, and see whether there's highlighted red to pay attention to best practices and their detail. And we can continue on and for the rest such as RF, Flex Connect, and Security best practices. This gives you the level of compliance in terms of scoring. And to increase it, we can simply configure the controller as needed. The final tool we'll be discussing is the Cisco Active Advisor. This is a free cloud-based service and that an admin can simply create an account and without anything to download, simply use a web browser to access this tool and be able to scan the network. This can be any number of Cisco devices, but in our example, we'll be using a wireless LAN controller. We'll put in the credentials of the wireless LAN controller and scan. Cisco Active Advisor will hide sensitive information such as username and password and other security detail. It will only look at the configuration and provide an audit for compliance 
and present a health score of each section in best practices. Similar to Config Analyzer, it will provide the individual best practices and its recommendation so that it provides guidance for the administrator to configure the controller as needed. Thank you for watching.